Amigos de Hoy Deportes, seguimos en el Rose Bowl de Pasadena, en donde Julian Klisman acaba de terminar la conferencia de prensa, en la que se mostró muy triste, pero también eh, se mostró también contento con lo que mostraron sus muchachos. Dijo que eh, por muchos instantes la selección de Estados Unidos pudo irse arriba en el marcador, inclusive ya después de que habían anotado el gol del empate. Y bueno, pues, ¿qué te pareció a ti la selección de Estados Unidos, Yad? ¿Y tú piensas que la era de Klisman debe continuar? Bueno, Eduard, tú sabes que yo era uno de los que primeramente pedía la cabeza de Klisman, no importaba el resultado, pero luego de lo que vi, creo que se merece otra oportunidad más. El equipo demostró otro, otro andar, mostró más ganas. Creo que ha sido uno de los mejores partidos, a pesar de la derrota, creo que ha sido uno de los mejores partidos que le hemos visto a Klisman en esta era. Escuchemos lo que dijo Jürgen Klisman en la conferencia de prensa. I think first of all a big big thank you to an amazing crowd here tonight. Unbelievable atmosphere. I don't know how many US supporters we had and it was it was an incredible um, experience. It was full of emotions, it was full of uh, um, intensity as we said before and um, and just a big thank you to all of them uh, to create that type of an atmosphere was 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 really uh, special. Uh, compliment to Mexico um, to win the game. A compliment to coach uh, Ricardo Ferretti um, to win the CONCACAF Cup. Um, I think it was an open game um, until the very, very end uh, when you thought already kind of, okay, how to, pre to prepare the penalty shootout. They hit you with that volley and, uh, and uh, yeah, leave you there. <laughs> Um, so I think you know the game was was um, very even, especially first half. I think we had enough chances actually to make score a, a, a second or a third goal. Uh, second half belonged more to Mexico, um, and uh, we turned it around again in the extra time. And also we were closer. At least that was our feeling. We were closer to the third goal than uh, Mexico was, but they they scored that third goal. So so again, uh, congratulations to them. Expecting, maybe we, we knew that they were coming again, you know, so we said let's, let's uh, be as compact as possible there. But what we didn't do well the second half, during the second half, was simply to keep the ball. We, we ran a lot after, we won a lot of balls, you know, and then we, boom, we couldn't combine it, we couldn't calm the game down enough, you know. That was a struggle really that went through the second half, which uh, we should have done better. No, you miss out on a big opportunity there of being in Russia in 2017, which Mexico now will participate, which uh, gives you the chance to learn about their infrastructure, you know, play very good teams, and uh, definitely an advantage to, to be prepared for that World Cup. There's no doubt about it. 